gotta go that way. How am I gonna eat this lobster? <laughs> guys today to one of the best park here in the middle of the city you guys so when I say it's in the middle of the city literally it's in the middle of the city you wouldn't even think there's something like this here. Whoop, oh, sorry. Like walking across one of the busiest highways here in Mega. That way is to go to the airport. This way is to go into town. And the good thing is it's accessible by BTS. How convenient is this? You can walk safely on your own all the way there. They have beautiful flower garden, butterfly garden, a place to have a picnic. Literally, the park is huge. One of the biggest parks I think I've ever been to anywhere. You can spend hours and hours there, but I just go run around the park Sometimes I would stop and look at the flowers. I haven't yet though gone into the actual butterfly garden. So if it's not too crowded today, we might try and venture in there. And I think it's free. Pretty sure it's free. Uh, this walkway right here is newly built. Uh, yeah. And <laughs> bonus today plus 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 it's not sunny it rained all night last night like I was telling you in my last vlog that uh, it's rainy season kind of monsoon season I think yeah so it's been raining quite a bit here actually it's been raining a lot at my mom's area too <sighs> see that took no time at all okay let's go best when you come early. Love it here. Today, I'm just walking because I have you guys and my bag full of stuff. So, <laughs> it's okay. I can walk. Walking is a form of cardio. Today, I'm just chilling. So, it's my rest day. And you guys, there's so many things to do here. Even if you wanted to go chill out in the middle of the beautiful pond they have here, you can take out this uh, little ducky paddle boat thingy for free. Look at that. Oh, look at that huge crow. But sadly, it's only open Oh gosh, the water. <laughs> I don't want to get wet. Um, but sadly, the paddle boat ducky thing is only open uh, at night because from now until, I guess, that time is pretty, uh, pretty hot. No one's really out there trying to, you know, get sweaty. And they even have a bike for you to rent for 30 baht. If 
you really wanted to and that right there is the bike lane Like you guys, where else is there a whoa, bees like this that you can just walk right through? This is crazy. Like look at this, it's so pretty. And there's like no one here. How is that? Maybe because it's still early. <laughs> I gotta go this way. <laughs> Besides the park ranger, cleaning up the area you can really hear the bird guys look at this oh man it's so pretty here like honestly I I didn't think that I never walked here guys there's turtles in the pond hi little guy He's like, maybe if I don't move, she won't see me. <laughs> Birds, quail. Let's go back. Well, it's kind of see. Even though it, um, even though it rained all night last night, it's not even damp or like muddy is what I was the word I was searching for oh, I love this place but mind you if it was any hotter than this I mean the pathway where you walk and stuff like that is all trees all shades laughing at myself I've always wanted to do that here <laughs> just laying on the ground looking up the sky you guys it's hot as F right now <laughs> social media versus reality it's like a hundred degrees outside right now if I can find my way out There we go. Oh, that way. We gotta go that way. Gotta go th that way. Whew, yeah. It's actually quite nice and windy. Lots of bees here, but of course, if you don't disturb them, they won't disturb you. Kind of attitude, right? <laughs> Let's go check out this uh, lotus pond right here. So all in all right now, we are currently, we've been, you and I, <laughs> have been in this park for about an hour 
and around roughly an hour and 15 minutes. And for the first time with you guys, I am gonna go into the butterfly garden. So when you first walk in, you have to register yourself, name, your identity, basically, and then you can go right in. It's nice because in this area, the reception, it's AC, so I'm kinda, let's get the AC for a little bit and then we'll go walk outside. Ooh, doo -doo, let's, let's read about the butterfly. I can't believe I caught that on camera. It just landed on my finger. You guys. What? Oh, finally. <laughs> wow. Wow. Well, that was the coolest thing I've done today. Hanging out with the butterfly. Now, I have to get out of here. Oof. <laughs> the sun's starting to come up behind the clouds. Oh, there's some out here too. You just be quiet and stay still. Sometimes they land on your hand. I got a few. Well, I couldn't get it on camera because by the time I whip my camera out or press record, it would just like fly away. Anyways, you guys, I need to go get some food. I'm hungry. It's windy. Nice and cool out here. Oof. All right. Oh my gosh, you guys, that was so much fun. It was so peaceful. There was koi in there, lots of little butterflies. I think there are different breed of butterflies there. Um, like you know how in North America, you when if you go into like one of those butterfly garden, like for for example, the one in Victoria, they have one there, and the butterflies are are different butterflies. You know what I mean? Yeah. Does that even make sense? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Let's find our way out. Usually when I come here. I would just run one track and it would take me all the way so today I just sort of went like zigzag so I don't really know where I am right now <laughs> I've never even been to this area of the park but yeah let's go have a seat and have a drink of water and then we can uh, figure out where we're gonna go after you guys I did a good quick like cardio slash fast walk and I showed you as much as I could and oof, it's getting late now I'm getting hungry I'm soaked <laughs> and it was beautiful it's good for the mind it's good for the soul fresh air I could say I saw lots of uh as you as you probably saw lots of birds animals um, there's this water lizard modern lizard monitored lizard thing it is a huge I couldn't get him on camera but it was like the size of my leg it was so like it was so quick into the into the um, the like one of the pond there because I think they are scared 
more scared of us than us scared of them. So, <laughs> and I'm sure they see a lot of people come by here on the regular. So, if you actually Google Map the park, uh, it will show you each uh, area of where everything is. Like, you it doesn't say where all the flower garden is, but the butterfly garden it will tell you where the, it is, where the entrance is, where the exit is. So it's very, very easy to navigate through the park. But yeah, you guys, I, you know, right now, I'm, to me, it's quite late. But there's, the only people, the only people I see around here are park maintenance. Wearing all the blue shirts, you know, keeping the park clean for everybody to come and enjoy. Isn't that right? Well, there's also a tennis court, basketball court, um, re bike rentals. I haven't yet rented a bike, but I think when I walked by, it was like a dollar or something, a dollar or like four dollars, something like that, to ride around the park. Um, one of these days, maybe, but I find if you're coming here to just look around and take pictures, I'd say that's a good idea. But if you want to like walk, run, just it's it's just do that pavement it's clean safe you know uh, time recommendation early mornings or late evening like six seven seven's pretty dark don't yeah it's pretty dark <laughs> maybe four or five but it's still really hot I think I'm gonna head back now soccer court tennis court basketball court this is actually the sports center of this park so yeah lots of things to do here of course there's nobody here right now because it's hot <laughs> like I'm soaked <laughs> you guys but uh, luckily there is a central plaza mall right by the BTS station so that's probably where I'm gonna end up getting my refreshments and maybe some snack before I hop on the train to go home uh, yeah, you guys, this was so much fun. I'm glad I get to show you things that possibly be an interest to you when and if you guys come to Thailand. So, I made it back to the walkway again <laughs> and I wasn't gonna make it till the mall so I stopped by to get some bananas at 7-eleven I already ate one uh, this is my second one one pack comes with two bananas for less than a dollar and yeah so after a good cardio this is a good energy source Bye -bye. อ๋อตามรูปเลยแต่แต่มันมันมีไฟมั้ยข้างล่างอ๋อโอเคอือฮึอ้าวน้ำเปล่าขวดนึงอ๋อเนี่ยซ้ําอ่าใช่มันมัน
You know, I haven't had tom yum in such a long time. Like a long time. The egg. The egg is a little bit more cooked than I like. As you know, I like my eggs a little bit um, like soft boiled. So I am riding solo today, running errand actually. I'm at Jet to Jack Market, FYI. Did you know that Jet to Jack Market is open not only on the weekend, but also Monday to Friday? Um, not the actual market itself, but the building that says Mix Jet to Jack. Monday to Friday and also weekends. It's actually, it, it's kind of like a, I want to call this like a mini mall. <laughs> um, they sell um, collectible toys, like collectible items, like art toys and souvenirs. Of course, there's restaurants like this one. If you just want to come and walk around. Mm -hmm. The thing with Tom Yum is there's a lot of um, there's a lot of <clears throat> a lot of uh, lemongrass in there, so you get a lot of this little things. So you need to be careful. Mushroom. And yes, it's spicy. Very spicy. What was I saying? <laughs> yeah, anyways. <laughs> this is why they have this long spoon, because when you have soup, it doesn't go to the bottom. Okay. Mm-hmm. Lemongrass. Mm. So yeah, when I'm done eating, I'll take you guys outside and let you guys know. It's, it is kind of cool to like see what the Jetsu Jack market is like when it's not on the weekend. Because when I first came here, I was like, oh my God, looks like a ghost town. Like it literally looks like a ghost town. And because all the, all, the, all the stalls are, are closed and there's nobody here except for like the the guards, right? And you kind of feel like uh, I shouldn't be here. You know, it's kind of like almost, it almost feels like a forbidden place that you shouldn't be here because there's nobody there and it's closed. I couldn't imagine coming here at night though because <laughs> this place is huge. To walk around here at night when there's nobody here, no lights, no nothing, it's kind of creepy, right? Mm. I feel like I got one of those lemongrass stuck in my throat. Maybe this egg will help. Huh. Wait for it to cool down first. Let's try and dig into this lobster. How am I going to eat this lobster without burning myself? Or having the juice literally like, like, oh, actually. I just have to get it out, get it out of the, yeah, I got it. There we go. In the picture, the lobster looks so big. <laughs> and, then, and then I asked the guy how, how big the bowl is. He's like, it's not that big. Because I was scared I wasn't going to be able to finish it, right? Mm.
Mm. Yeah, it's good. It's really good. I really want this egg. <laughs> but I nearly choked on the last one because it was so hot. Mmm. This is good. Yeah, I can't even remember the last time I had tom yum, to be honest with you. Perfect meal. So this is my first meal of the day, the real meal. Besides those, um, <laughs> the two bananas I had earlier. Yes. And today, actually, I'm gonna go meet up with my friend for dinner at this market. It's called Talat. Talat Pool. It's quite a bit away, away, like half an hour from where I am. Bring you guys along, of course. Um, it's near this like train station, and you can actually hop on the train and go to the next town if you wanted to, which takes 45 minutes. And it costs like three dollars, something like three, four dollars. Or no, let let's not quote that maybe less than ten dollars let's just say that <laughs> mm. the lemongrass pieces because technically you're not supposed to eat it it's hard on your digestive system and it's like It's um, it's tough, like eating sugar cane almost. Oh, I lost the egg white. Man, you guys are gonna get like the full vlog today. Like the park from this morning, the market later, <laughs> and kind of market now. Well, I say kinda because it's it's closed and nothing, I don't think anything interesting is open other than um, plant stores, plant stores, souvenir stores. That's about it. Maybe like house decoration stores, I think. I don't even know, so... <laughs> That's the mall name. Mix Jack to Jack. Food court. You can go up there. There's three floors. Wow, it's hot. So this is what it looks like <laughs> when it's closed. It's pretty creepy, like I said. So this is like, usually all this stall is like open, right? Maybe I should put a hat on. One second. Stalls are open, I guess. But I don't know if they're open for business or. Oh, yeah, they are actually, like this one. Oh, uh, closed. Because you guys wanted to see something that isn't on the usual BKK, you know, tourist things, I guess. So. Here it is. Oh, I, I wonder if I could go that way. So this would be all food. Let's just go back this way because we know the entrance or the exit is right there. Plant stores. Flower store. Hat store. Mostly plants, souvenirs. I have my fan. 
but I can assure you it doesn't help <laughs> because it's so it's like you're blowing hot air so you know so it's like it's not even cooling you down or anything oh lemon tree anyway these type of things wooden plates so souvenirs pretty much oh some clothing stores This is what it looks like. <laughs> I'm basically making my way back to the train. So I figured I'd go this way. Like look at that. As far as the eyes can see. As far as the eyes can see that way. It's closed. Everything's closed. Except for the random stores like I said. Fingers crossed I don't get lost in here. <laughs> These souvenir stores go that way that way let's go this way I know where I am Little bar. And now I've made it to the front entrance. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, this entrance is closed. You have to walk all the way around. But any other day it's open. Your fruits right there. I'm making my way back to the train now. I don't know if I uh yeah, I said that already. <laughs> I mean, I could keep walking around in circles, but it's all the same thing. Once you come to Jeff to Jack one time, you basically would know what they sell here. Souvenirs, household things, uh, flower shops, trees, a um, little bit of food. Yeah, no, quite a bit of food. When the when the weekend market is open so yeah you can just literally pick one aisle and just spend most of your time there instead of like having to walk in circles around and around and having to find the same shop over and over again that sells the same things you know anyway I feel like I'm chit chatting quite a bit on this one <laughs> I'm gonna make my way to the train now and um, I will see you guys later when I meet up with my friend so yeah that's it probably gonna go get some food hang out for a bit 12 seconds later guys the bike ride took three minutes literally three minutes and it was like less than a dollar so we're gonna try and find some food now because I'm starving as usual always bring an empty stomach when you go to the market of course oh. sausage Of course, the first stall I see. Squid. Oh my god, look at the dessert. Oh my god. No, it's too early. I gotta eat first. The train's coming. 
ียวมันบ้านเราเลยแทบไหมเดินไปฝั่งนู้นไหมบัวลอยสดเพิ่มทับพิมกรอบพุดดิ้งเต้าห้วยอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอืมอ
มไม่หวานมากมันก็เลยอร่อยถ้ามันหวานมากมันกินเยอะไม่ได้เอาอิลี่เอาอิลี่เขาไม่มาบ้านIt's not sweet. At all. This is sweet. My favorite. It's almost finished. It's like the perfect sweetness too. It's shaved ice, right? But it's like milk-shaped ice. Usually I come here um, during the day. Today's the first day that I am here at night. So I, I thought there would be more like stalls. Notice it's like an older style house on the top. I love those. Starting to pour 